Um, next up from Northern United Humboldt Charter School. <laughs> yes, we have uh, Mariana Ennis and Kiara Ennis. Come on out, y'all. My name is Phyllis Wheatley. I was born in West Africa in 1753. When I was seven years old, I was taken from Africa to board a ship to America, where I was sold into slavery as many other African children. When I was kidnapped in 61, board a ship when my new life begun. I was sold as a slave, but I knew I had to be brave. The Wheatley family some teaching, so I began to learn to read and I learned to write and write. I write and write, write and write and all the time. I gained my freedom in 73, learned about God who set us free, so I continue to write and write. On my own, no, that didn't last long. Cause been gone, I was all alone, but still I ride and arrive. I ride. I ride and arrive, ride and arrive. All the even though my races look down on, I know that there's a God watching over me. He gives us freedom, He gives us love, and welcomes us. All I became the first African-American woman to be published. My first poem came out in 1767. I wrote many poems along with many writings to many people, including George Washington. I died with my remaining child in December of 1784. Many people today still admire my poems and writings. I encourage you all to stand up for what you believe in, as I did. Wow, let's take a bow, let's take a bow, because that was, right here, you guys, right here, these two.